my teacups and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be doing something that I have wanted to do for so long. <laughs> this challenge incorporates two things that I really, really love and those two things are books and fashion. So I am going to be turning my books into outfits. I've seen this trend going around on booktube. I love this idea. I think it's going to be so much fun. So I have brought most of my books into our bedroom. I usually keep them in our spare bedroom, but I thought I would bring them over here on my little TBR cart so that way I'm not having to go like from the spare bedroom back to our bedroom and so on and so forth. So I'm gonna take a look at my books first and see what we're working with. I know very specifically what color palette I have in my wardrobe. I really like pastels, I have a lot of pink, I have a lot of yellow and white and those sorts of colors, but I need to see how many of my books can actually go with my wardrobe. So let's take a look and see what we are working with. Also, I will try and link as many things as I can down below. Some of these things are probably going to be things that I've had in my wardrobe for quite some time, so they may not be available anymore, but I will try to find as many links as I can. Okay, so here are some of my books and we have quite a few different colors going on so we could definitely do a lot with this so let's see is anything jumping out at me hmm okay we're gonna go for this if there's one color that I have a lot of in my wardrobe it is pink let's take this to my wardrobe let's see what we can do you better turn up you better be there when I shake Watch me rockin' if I can't stop If I should fall, just go ahead Go and catch me, baby Oh my gosh, actually, I have a pair of pants that are like the same color as this. Oh my gosh, this is like so perfect. <laughs> okay, so we've got the pants, and since this is about being a fangirl, I think we should kind of throw in something to go with that theme. So I have a lot of Harry Potter shirts, and I'm a huge Harry Potter fangirl, so I think we're gonna tie that in with that. I think we're gonna go with, yeah, let's go with this because that ties in with that. Oh, that looks so good! Do you like it? I think the downside is I have a lot of yellow in my wardrobe, but I don't have yellow books. So I think we're gonna have to like skip that section of my wardrobe, which is a shame, but I do have blue. You know what, I actually, I have a shirt that would go perfect for this. Let's go. Okay, back to the closet. And this is what I have in mind. Okay, this with this. Now, I have a pair of jeans from Amuse Society that I think would be great for One of Us is Lying. Okay, so these are the jeans and they are distressed jeans and I don't know, they just kind of give off the vibe of one of us is lying. Okay, there's that. I think since the cover of the book is kind of like a neutral color, I think I'm gonna go with this taupe colored top from Luca in gray. And then I think to give this outfit, I want it to be like a little bit more edgy because this book is like like a thriller. So I think it needs like a belt or something. Okay. I think we're gonna go with this black belt. So I'm thinking this black belt from Target. Hmm, I have a lot of colors I can work with here. And I think this skirt from Luca and Gray would be really cute with 
a Harry Potter t-shirt. Let me go ahead and show you. I think it'll be perfect for the Sorcerer's Stone. Okay, let me see. Yes, this one right here. So this is from Seeker and Slade. So I think like these two things together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see here. So we have the Nimbus shirt. And that is so perfect for Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Okay, so three outfits. I wonder how many I'm gonna do total. Let's just see how many we can do. I actually have something so perfect for a study in Charlotte. So I have a trench coat, which would be really, really great. So I'm gonna get that from downstairs. Okay, here we go. I have my trench coat from Target. Okay, this with this. So I have about six outfits picked out. So now it is time for the lookbook. I love it. today's video let me know in the comments down below which outfit was your favorite I think my favorite was the outfit I put together for a study in Charlotte I just really liked the trench coat and the little magnifying glass um, it was really random that I had a magnifying glass my mom actually got that for Harold for I think his 30th birthday but anyway, <laughs> this was so fun. I might do a part two, I don't really know. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys again soon. Bye.